Welcome to Adam Home Cooking. Today we are preparing savory rice. These are the ingredients for preparing savory rice. I've got my white rice here. I've got my butter, my chopped bacon, my vegetables, peas, carrots, chopped onion and chopped spring onion. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use some of the butter just a chunk. I'm going to use this much to fry my onion, bacon and the vegetables before adding the rice. And this is my butter, salted butter. You can get butter from any supermarket. If you don't like butter, you can use margarine, but it tastes better with the butter. Then I fry my onion first. Just for about two to three minutes. And then I add my chopped bacon. Remember, butter is salted and the bacon too is salted. So you need to be careful adding salt. I add my bacon. And then I cook it through, just like you are doing stir fry. Now I cook my bake, bacon through. I cook my bacon with the onion in the butter. Now I'm going to add the rest of my vegetables. The chopped carrots, peas, and the spring onion. You can also add mixed pepper if you like. Then I cook it. You do it like you are, as you are doing stir fried. Meanwhile, I've washed my rice already. You can wash your rice and dry it, or you can the rice is long grain rice, it's already clean, so you can just add it to this, or you wash your rice and add it straight with the water to this. Then you cook all this vegetable for about five minutes and then you add your rice. The bacon and the mixed vegetables. And then you keep on stir frying, keep on cooking it through. you can taste it before adding the salt remember the bacon is salted and the butter too is salted so you can taste it I'm going to add my water don't add cold water add boiled water from the kettle adding my water And then I'll taste for the salt. Now I need a bit of salt. With the salt, you can add a bit at a time and then you taste it to suit your taste. You can use tablespoonful or teaspoon. And then you stir it again. Taste for the salt. Now it's the salt is okay, so you cover it to cook. Turn down the fire and cook on a low heat. You just cook it as you are cooking normal rice. And then you open it occasionally to see if it's not cooked enough. You add more salted water. Because if you just add ordinary water, it's going to take, take that taste of the salt out. So remember to add salted water. I'm going to check my rice. The water is, is all dried up, so I'm going to check if it's ready. If it's not cooked, 
then I'll add a bit more of salted water. Use your fork to stir your rice because if you use a spoon or a wooden spoon, it will go mushy. I think my water is okay. I just need to cover it a bit to steam it up to dry the excess water from the rice. Our savory rice is ready to be served. It can be eaten on its own because it's been seasoned and there is meat, vegetable and everything in it already. You can be served with your shito, your pepper sauce or eating on its own like this. Here we are. Our savory rice is ready. Enjoy.